So yeah, there's some treasure to be had. It's just a lot of fun to rip this open. There's one hit. That's why it's so low priced. There's a lot of big, huge hits in here, but it's a one hit box. And uh, well, we'll see what we can get. It's 15.50 for two teams in this. Probably have another one he's available, but let's go. Let's do some randoming. We're gonna random each list seven times. We're gonna stack the list up side by side right here so let's get this thing going on the randomizer and see what we can find who's going to get what team in the break leaf football is getting really close i'm not sure i'll be checking into that all right our first list boom there is lucky number seven whoops there we go Now for our very next list. Lucky number seven. Rays up there in the number two position. Who's got who's got the Rays? Mike, you own the Rays. That's one of the very best teams. Good luck with the Wander. Talk about the Mariners too, and you've got the Julio Rodriguez chances, and who has the Angels? Mike. Wow, Mike, you got the three very best teams. I think that they are the best teams. I think you have them in the box break. We'll see what happens though. I'm going to put this in alphabetical order by the team's name, and I know the Royals are big. There's Bobby Witt Jr. is in here, and uh, good luck with any teams you have in this thing. Let's see what we got. I hope we can pull a monster out of this thing in gold label baseball. Okay, this is definitely the framed autographed hit. So I'm going to put this to the side. Save that for last. So there's three classes of card. And the class threes are more rare. So when you get a parallel and it's a numbered parallel, well, we're going to look really closely to see if it's a class three because the some of the class threes are much better certainly some of the rookie cards that's a class two there's photo variations so hopefully we can get some class threes out of here that's a class three right kind of hard to tell it's always so small on a gold label Okay, no, that's a class one. There's a Bobby Witt Jr. rookie right there. Nice. All right. And is that a class three? That's a class one. O'Neill Cruz, class one. Bryce and Scott. I always like to look at the rookies. That's a class one.
Thanks, Royce Lewis, class two. And the Cubs, class one. Class two, Austin Riley. Nice, Julio Rodriguez. I need to turn the brightness up or something. Let me turn the brightness up real fast. Where? I still can't see it. Is that a class two or a class three? Might be class three. It's hard for me to tell. I'll look at it at the end of the box break. Let's keep it moving. These are real easy to see. They're class ones. Ichiro, class one, Willie Mays, and class two, Rays rookie. Okay, here we go. What's it going to be? Coming out of here, there's a frame in the middle. So bear in mind, even though you're seeing a card, it's not the frame card right off the get-go. It's a Kirby Puckett on the outside, but our hit is sandwiched in between two cards. It's a framed gold frame, so it's not going to be a one-of-one. -one. But it still could be a double auto. I guess it still could be a one of one somehow. Here we go. Gold label. Austin Meadows autograph. Who? Oh, nice. Congratulations, Mike. You oh, you've got yourself this autograph in the box break. Austin Meadows on card. Framed gold label baseball auto. All right, nice hit. So good things coming out in gold label. You always get a really big chance to pull some monster hits in there. It's a lot of fun breaking that open. For some reason, I just cannot tell what class this is, but it looks like a class three to me. I think it's a class three. So that's a really good rookie card to have of Julio Rodriguez. Fun break to do. Go label baseball. Hope.